Hello everyone, my name is Brian, this is Dormant Volcano Games, and you are here for another episode of Watch Dogs Legion. Just a little bit of a heads up, if your name is JD from Jack Bear Games, or you are someone who does not want to know the identity of Zero Day, because you are currently playing the game yourself, stop right here. Stop. Do not watch any longer until you have gone and completed this section of the game. I won't be offended, no worries, come back when you're done. If you don't care about the identity of Zero Day, or you've already played this section of the game, then sit back, relax, and enjoy. Uh-oh. Not the most inviting clubhouse, is it? Judging from the security above, I'd expect some unorthodox defense measures. Jesus. Actually, wait a second. That worked. Come on, come on, come on. Looks kind of like our base, but different. So I think we're good. Oh. I set off everything. Guess not everything. There's something weird up ahead. I'm gonna check it out. All right, 
I think it's safe to say we found Zero Day's base of operations. Bagley, what can you tell me about this place? It's, uh, not authorized. How can it be not authorized? Pardon? Not authorized by who? By, hmm, apparently I can't say. Can I say this is really fucking annoying? Oh, well, there's that at least. Jim, someone's hacking into Bagley. Listen, have a look around, but exercise caution. Yes, I may be able to analyze individual data points. Suggest you make this a quick investigation, though. I'm picking up Albion activity in the area. Possible they are searching for Zero Day as well. Oh, fun. Zero Day appears to be running the chip tracking tech we acquired from Mary Kelly. Now, what do you suppose they're doing with it? The effort that goes into a deceit is proportional to how fucked up the result is. I don't like this. Zero Day has reverse engineered Themis drones. Could they have their own private fleet? Zero Day has a backdoor into filament, that deep surveillance supercomputer Malik was so concerned about. This is the Bagley source code, a copy of my brain from Broker Tech, code we acquired in Sky Larson's lab. Jesus Christ. Clearly, DedSec has been unwittingly nicking toys for Zero Day. I'm detecting some devices over in the crash pad that could fill in some details. like a stinger, eh? Oh, ease up, please. Let him breathe. Who's this guy? Our very own Guy Fawkes. It's the wrong mask, though. Fuck you. We didn't set that bomb. We defused it. Even if I was inclined to believe a dead second insurgent, do you think it really matters at all? Since when does Albion get to play judge, jury, and executioner? You have no jurisdiction in London. <sighs> oh, I do now. Listen up. Get all your units to move in and lock down the city. Provide medical aid. Help the injured. And guns out. Let's make it look good for the fucking cameras. Understand? Did this used to be a dead sec hideout? That's what it looks like. Well, well. If I were a betting AI, I'd say Nigel Cass mm -hmm. had advanced knowledge of the London bombings and the location of that dead sec safe house. Almost like someone tipped him off. But I suppose you'll put this together in your own time. It's time for a hard reset. It's time for a hard reset. But that would mean that Sabine is zero day. Oh my god. Breakups are hard. Is London burning? No parts of it. Then I've held up my end. Release the filament code. Uh, one of your dead sex squad Begin. stopped the parliament bomb. I was rather counting on that one, to be honest. This is still the largest terror attack in London's history. <gasps> if you can't work with that... <laughs> oh, I'll work with it. But the deal is off. Do you know who you're fucking with, Mr. Cass? I know you set off bombs across the city and fucked your friends. I don't know what mischief you'll get up to with a big girl toy like Filament. Cleaner this way, though. She's running! Get her! She killed Dalton, 
set up the attacks, and she's tampered with Bagley. Explains why she wiped my memory. There's a lot to unpack here, but more pressingly, I've pinpointed where Draw Britannia is running. That console right over there. This is very confusing. I found Drill Britannia. It looks to be a CTOS patch. I don't know if I can stop it. No one can stop it. That's the whole point. So... Impressed? Depends. What does Drill Britannia do? <laughs> it's society's big wipe. While DeadSec runs around fixing bugs, I'm deleting the source code. Frying the hardware, too. All of it. It's actually a beautiful thing you've done by helping to steal all that tech. So beautiful you had to build a doomsday bomb shelter just to hide away from it. When's the rest of Zero Day show up? Huh? Oh, it's just me. I learned very early on that no one was willing to make real sacrifice for change in the end history's actors work alone jesus you really are just another zealot ouch i had hoped you might at least understand why i did it why we recruits i am sorry but once again dead sec has outlived its usefulness Spread out! millions will suffer today it's an honor to die among them. Search the area! Oh no. Sabine's locked me in here with the Albion Foods. I need time to crank the security system and open the blast doors. Try to survive until the process is complete. Easier said than done. to intercept operatives across the city. Oh, excellent. I'm under attack again.
Jeez, they just keep coming. Attack anybody? Thanks. So yeah, can we talk about the fact that I definitely did not suspect Sabine? Like, did anybody? I didn't, for sure. You can find it. Wait, one second. trying to stop me as badly. At least when they are, they're not doing a very good job. Are they just gonna keep coming till I get out of here? So, hey guys, uh, I'm back. Uh, I learned some very unfortunate news, which is the fact that this mission, um, whether intentionally or not, never actually stops. I mean, it stops, obviously. What happens is it keeps just spawning more enemies. So you basically just have to keep going forward.
Oh wow, they seriously do just keep coming. So it looks like, I looked it up, whether it's a bug or not, uh, they just keep spawning. That is so annoying. Like, it, no one has some with, like, infinite ammo. Why would- You'll need to find another exit. Albion has dispatched personnel to intercept operatives across the city. Excellent, I'm under attack again. So that method doesn't work. Great. Me. That was intense, but I escaped. Yes, brilliant work. Oh, joy. What's going on? We've been swarmed by Albion at every turn. Yeah, they're giving us all grief. We need to sync up. Sabina's leaked your locations to Albion. All operatives are currently compromised. I suggest you all lay low and avoid any large groups. I'll send you a low-key meeting spot. Try me. Oh. Hey, I'm trying to avoid the coppers. I'm gonna do what I gotta do. Whoa. Hey. Ha. Okay, so I would just like to point out, uh, as I did the last time this happened, uh, get a getaway driver. Just for the last couple of missions. If you can get a getaway driver with a, like a good gun, that'd be probably better. I kind of want to do a version of this game where I go back 
and like I don't complete missions unless I am super okay I don't think we I have a way out of here oh that might work So, yeah, I'm definitely dying here. Sorry, guys. That's all we have time for today. I hope you enjoyed the episode and my little attempt at brevity when we learned the identity of Zero Day. I gotta say, considering the fact that I shot this all the way back in November, uh, it is now January. I'm not as surprised anymore going through and watching my edit of this walkthrough. I don't know how I didn't guess that Sabine was Zero Day. And I feel kind of silly. So just so I feel a little less silly, comment down below if you figured out before hitting that moment that Sabine was Zero Day. And also let me know if you enjoyed that, because I will do things like that in the future if you guys did. Also, like the video, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. We only have two episodes left, so I hope you enjoy them. If you've done all that, I'll see you next time.